I've got you now. What? Oh no. Oh no. This is not okay. This is not okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I do this to myself, but I tried playing Fallout New Vegas as a pacifist. Sure, didn't make me feel like a pacifist, but let me show you how it went. I like how I'm getting all of these free things like a machete and throwing spears from DLC. Enter character's name. I love peace. Hey, this guy isn't a very good doctor. He hasn't picked up that something is wrong. Yeah, he's definitely a bad doctor. This is what he's done to me. But just like when you get a bad haircut and you're too polite to say anything, I'm gonna be like, yeah, that's good. Thank you. All right, let's just put his charisma up full. That's what all his points are going into since we won't be fighting. I want to see why you think it's okay to go messing with my face. At this perspective, it looks like my guy's an absolute giant four eyes. Just say I need glasses. What a cool trait to have. The more we can hide, the better. In fact, does he have any glasses just lying around that I could steal? I mean, I could take these. I'm a pacifist, but I'm still kind of a bastard. <laughs> just taking his notes as well. <laughs> that doesn't even help me. Oh, I thought I'd go to the toilet, but I'm drinking from the toilet. <laughs> so if I remember correctly, there's a little quest here at the start, and it ends up with you finding a bad guy in this building. Hello! <laughs> Please put down your gun, I'm a pacifist. He asked me, do I want to play a game of caravan? He's still pointing the gun at me. I don't feel like I have a choice. You need a hired gun, I'm available. <laughs> Should I mention that I'm not willing to hurt anyone? Okay, so he's hiding from the powder gangers, but I, I don't really want to defend him, because that would involve violence. Speaking of of which I should put my fists away. For a pacifist, I'm kind of ready to throw hands. Hey! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Talk about a jump scare. What are you doing waiting at the door like that? Is that big iron I can hear in the background? <laughs> I'm going to help Ringo take on the powder gangers. I never said I would do that. Okay, she's in. We might die horribly. Well, maybe not me. <laughs> oh my god, look at all these objectives. Can I just turn them in? Okay, I've convinced two of them to join the fight. I have neglected to mention that I won't be joining the fight. I'm just signing everyone else up. I'm just a recruiter of sorts. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Um, yeah, sure, let's do this. <laughs> I don't even know where the powder gangers are. The powder gangers are here to play. They're here already? Let's go. Oh, there they are. Slow marching into town. Uh, th they're opening fire. All right. Well, I'm out of here. You guys, best of luck. I'm just a mediator here and, uh, well, I'm going on break. Yeah, I think it's going well. <laughs> I think it's, it's too hard to even see who's fighting who. Oh, there we go. I think that was a bad guy. Did we win? <laughs> And when I say we, I don't include me in that. But I want my reward if you did win. Okay, looks like I picked the right side. We can talk after this is over. Oh, I thought it was over. My bad. Am I in danger? Oh my god, did her dog die? Ah, may as well take the dog meat. <laughs> Just to see if there's any response. No, nothing. What about the human meat? Can I take that? No, but there's dynamite. Not that I'll ever use it. Is anyone wearing glasses? <laughs> I can't see without my glasses or... Your glasses in this case. Good spring settlers fleeing. I don't think so. I think it is over. Easy Pete is fleeing. He's not. <laughs> or else they're just really not good at fleeing. All right. Well, looks like me not helping has completely bugged this quest. So no reward for me, I'm afraid. Warning. Death claws ahead. Well, I mean them no harm. They won't fight me, would they? Uh-oh. Oh god, those things look scary. I Oh god, they're fast too. They've got many more legs than I do. Oh, good thing he's got a little bit smaller brain. Okay, I made it to here. I'm actually surprised I made it this far. What's your problem? Come back. Why are you running away? <laughs> what the hell? There are death claws all over the damn place north of here. I'd turn back if I were you. No, I just came through here. I'm heading south. No, I will not listen. Whoa! What? Why are they all running away? I don't understand. Everyone's fleeing. Could it just be that I'm ugly? Is that it? When do you think the NCR will send their troops Poor to help Snuffles. us? Wait, who? Snuffles? Who the hell is Snuffles? If it's one of them, they have no problem with their legs because they just ran off. Like, they just warned me about this place and now they're running into the territory. Oh my god, he's about to get mangled. <laughs> he's fist fighting one. Well, maybe he should have been a pacifist too because I'm sneaking through here whether they like it or not. The strip is right there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He's gonna be fast, isn't he? Oh, he's very fast. Oh, there's another one right there. All right, jump. The only thing I'll hurt is my legs. I refuse to hurt another person. Okay, he's running after me. And not to worry, there's a building right here, and we're gonna hide inside it. I can feel him right behind me. Jesus! 
Well, there goes old pacifist. Or what's his name again? I love peace. Sorry. Well, I love being alive, so I'm gonna reload and try that again. Oh god, oh god. Oh no, oh no, he spotted me. He's coming around and that one's just waiting for me. Okay, here I go. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna run straight for this building this time. Don't panic, don't panic. That's what got me killed last time. It's because I turned around, panicked, and then got stuck. Oh god, he's right behind me. The door's locked. The door is feckin' locked. Okay, I've confused them with the terrain. Keep going, keep going. What the hell is that? There's a machine gun fire now. Oh, he's almost caught me, but I'm gonna jump off. <laughs> Please don't follow me. Maybe I should run towards the machine gun fire. I know that's not something you should usually do, but as a pacifist, I'm okay with other people killing, and I need protection. Did I... Did I make it? I think they gave up. Oh my god, I actually did it. Oh, now I'm conflicted because they're running in to fight the Death Claws and I kind of want this guy's hat. So I'm hoping maybe if he dies, I can get it. But you know, the Death Claws are going to be hanging around his corpse. But I really like that hat. It looks so good on me. And there he goes, dead already. No, don't, don't, don't throw them over here. Oh. Okay. Oh no, they're after me now too. I had no part in this. No part. Stop running at me. Oh, they just launched me forward. Maybe that'll give me enough. No, it won't. All right. The hat is not worth my death. One day I'll own a hat. One day. Oh, they turned the lights on just for me. That's nice. All right. I'm here now to find some work that doesn't involve killing. I'm afraid I'm going to have to search you before letting you in. Uh, sure. I mean, I'm not going to use them anyway. It would actually be doing me a favor because I've got given these random throwing spears that I don't really want anymore. I was wondering if you had any work available for a pacifist at this weapon store. We currently need another body to guard the entrance outside. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> I'll happily be an NPC. Ah, uh, here we go. Being the protagonist, huh? What? <laughs> what are you staring at? Don't tell me you're my new guard. That's right. <laughs> I feel like these guys are children just role-playing that they have this store. They're just playing make-believe. There are no customers here. Wow, what a handsome boy. He grew up so fast. He's got his armor and everything. Hi there. Is this where I can pick up a laser gun? <laughs> <laughs> the drunk voice, but the emotionless expression. Yeah, you seem capable of looking after yourself. Welcome to the Silver Rush. What? I work here. <laughs> Why are you welcoming me? How do I know you're not drunk? <laughs> because I'm not. All right, sir. You do you. Not bad, huh? Looks like we got another customer. Yep, looks like we do. Uh, I don't know what his name is, but I'm gonna guess it's Mr. The slowest Walker of all time. I'm just gonna tell him no immediately. Why the hell not? I think you might be drunk. <laughs> you keep losing us business like that. What are you talking about? That drunk guy, I mean the sober guy will buy loads. It's not my fault all that's approaching is riffraff. What? Oh my god, he's shooting at me because I abandoned my post. I was going to the bathroom, I have a bladder issue. All right, now I have a death issue. Being a pacifist is hard when everyone just wants to kill you because of who you are as a person. Have you been drinking? <laughs> I ask everyone, except the actual drunks. Are you talking back to me? Damn, I knew this wasn't gonna work. Wait, what? Stop it. What? What um, the hell do you suppose that was about? I don't know, but his head is rolling around, and I think it's discovered perpetual motion. It just keeps going. Oh, you got rid of it. Thank you. That was pretty disturbing. So what the hell was that about? Welcome to the, uh, Silver Rush. We decapitated our last customer. Get out of here before you get hurt. Let's take this chump, guys. What? Oh, no. I, I didn't know my words would have consequences. Oh, I tried to get in, but the door's locked. Ah, uh, help me. <laughs> oh, he's also shooting at me now because I abandoned my post. For God's sake. Sake. I like that the objective is still defeat the powder gangers back in that village. What did I? What? Just because I kicked a barrel? I'm frustrated. This job isn't that good, you know? I don't have any benefits. Okay, what about if I use this guy's cover this time? Why doesn't he care about me at all? Welcome to the Silver Rush. <laughs> Will you stop welcoming me? And then just stares off into the abyss. There we go. I stole the key. Now I can go in, right? I've lost karma. Oh, my bad for stealing a key when I'm getting shot at. <laughs> just playing whack-a-mole with him now. Welcome to the Silver Rush. 
I know, I know, I know. Welcome to the silver rush. You know what? I'm gonna load and I'm gonna be more cooperative with this man. As I continue to be a pacifist in game, the urge to kill in real life rises. That's a good dog. Okay, and this alternate reality called me a dog, so I'm not sure which is worse. Okay, that was an awful day. I got called a dog. Can I get paid now? You had a little bit of a hard time following instructions. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much me in a nutshell. I cut 200 bottle caps. I let one drunk in. Unfortunately, I found someone else with a little more experience, and he'll take over the position starting tomorrow. Oh, they replaced me. She's being nice about it, though. <laughs> Trying to downplay how awful I did. I need you to run a package out to a discreet location that the client has chosen. Okay, sounds good. I'm not a delivery boy. I literally am. I'm the courier. <laughs> I, I stuck myself behind a door. Not a great look for a guy who's looking for work. <laughs> Just jumping around these explosives. I want to move this flamethrower somewhere else so I can pick it up out of their view. But it's proving more difficult than I originally hoped. Yes, okay. Got it moving. <laughs> there we go off into the corner. Yes! Haha! <laughs> they didn't notice. All right, I have something to sell. Yeah, I've got this flamer. I, yeah, I'd accept 347 caps. That seems fair. You know, you'll make a profit on that, I'm sure. <laughs> Our business is four caps now. All right, good luck. I'll be back for my money when I complete this quest of yours. I'm very honest and reliable. Two things that are often said about me. Oh, and another thing. I'm extremely humble. One of the most humble men you'll ever meet. Why can I still hear loads of voices around me even though I've left the strip? All right, well, that could drive you absolutely demented. All right, fingers crossed this mission doesn't involve violence. Why am I naked? <laughs> oh, how did my vault suit come off? I didn't take it off myself. It must have just fell off. You ever just running along and your clothes just fall off? Please say yes. I'm trying to mount a legal defense. Oh, no, that sound means violence, doesn't it? Aww. Many legs bastards are after me. Oh no, the guy I'm supposed to talk to is now running from the many legged bastards. Or else from me. <laughs> I am just a naked dude who's running at him in the desert. Oh my god, I was like, why is he running that way now? <laughs> oh, that thing is gonna turn on me. Okay, the scorpions are fighting the other monster thing. Great. That was actually incredibly lucky, I imagine. Uh oh, that's not lucky. Oh no, even his goofy run. Oh no, no, I'm hidden. It says I'm hidden, don't run at me. He's terrifying, like he's so goofy. It's like he's something out of Super Mario, but he is at the same time terrifying. He looks like he could rip me in two. Okay, what if I just wait two hours here? All right, he's gone slightly. No, he's, he's not gone very far, has he? I was about to say he's gone slightly down the road, but not really. Okay, I'm gonna mount this like those mountain goats. Oh. <laughs> There's the end of the map. <laughs> Maybe I can still like skirt around on the top here sneaking. Oh, I've triggered him. <laughs> He's just running all over the place though. He doesn't know how to get up here. You know, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to do like full on missions as a pacifist when being a courier doesn't even work as a pacifist. I had no idea my mailman went through stuff like this. Okay, I've managed to lost old goober over there. That's what I'm calling him. Can we finally talk now? But you would have something for me. Now do you or not? Do I? I actually have no no idea. Okay, was that it? Here's your payment. What? Th that's it? I was just delivering it? Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> to finalize this deal, I need to tie up a loose end. To do that, there's a girl I need you to find. Her name is Rose of Sharon Cassidy. That's a weird name. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be talking. <laughs> Mr. I love peace all caps. Bring her back here so we can talk. Okay, I'm on it. It's been days and they're still just standing there. I had to travel here to go and find that woman who's just down the road. Am I still hearing voices? I feel like I'm actually going mad. I can still hear voices. What? <laughs> can you please look at me? Because this kind of looks like a face and it's freaking me out. My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge. And I can't get to her. Doesn't sound like a job for me. <laughs> Goodbye. Bastard. Well, joke's on you, because you're the only other person around here. So you just insulted yourself. You will? 
Yeah, sure. I'm just gonna say yes and then not help him because he was rude to me. Oh no. I can't hear you. <laughs> You're so far away. Just gonna ignore him. I think the excuse that I didn't hear him would actually hold up. He spoke to me from so far away. Oh my god. Okay, I was like, why is the boss music playing? Jesus Christ, they're really fast. All right, can I make it to anywhere before I die a horrible death? Maybe that building? All right, I made- Oh no, there are scorpions. Can you guys fight each other? That would be fantastic. Oh, they are. Okay. It keeps giving me the tooltip to enter vats because I'm just not doing it because I don't want to fight. Whoa! What? Is it my nose? Is that what you're screaming about? Okay, here's the woman. Jean Baptiste. She's making fun of his name. I'm glad they all have weird names because it's taking the focus off my name. Interested in uh, following me to Freeside? Not leaving here until my caravan paper's clear. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, let me do her quest and then surely she'll follow me. Hey, I'm gonna wake you up because I'm trying to do quests over here. I appreciate someone who sleeps in their best formal wear outfit, though. Did Dr. Hildern... This really isn't any of my business, but... Did he give you a job? Yeah, weirdly enough, he did. He asked me to get some data from Vault 22, even though I was just delivering an invoice. I don't know why he picked me. But you're not the first person Hildren sent out to the vault. Ah, okay, so he just sends everyone out. None of them came back. <laughs> he just keeps sending people out to die. Well, I leveled up. Time to put it all in speech and continue. And I'll get the lady killer perk. You know, anything to avoid fighting. Because... Funny enough, even though it's called Lady Killer, it's not about killing ladies. All right, I did your bloody fetch quest. Now can you come with me so I can deliver you in my other bloody fetch quest? Help the others around here too. Oh my god. <laughs> Why do I have to do so much for this woman just so she'll follow me off into the desert? Clear the roads for Jackson Mojave Outpost. How the hell am I supposed to do that? <laughs> Unless it's literally like sweeping or something? I don't think I can do it. Oh my god, I can't believe it, but I found someone who kind of looks like me. A hard Jesus Christ, what is it with them and jump scares? I'm a pacifist, but I'm gonna punch one in the throat by accident in a second. Okay, I came back to where I got the mission in the hopes that I can find some evidence of some attack to persuade her to come with me instead of doing this mission that involves killing, because I'm a coward. A pa pacifist! Yeah, stay right there. Okay, awesome. Now everyone just look away for a second. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> I was wondering why I wasn't able to pickpocket her. There we go. <laughs> That's the perfect spot. A safe key. All right, she didn't like that. Oh, actually, she was indifferent on it. Don't look at me like that. All right, I'm just gonna wait behind her for 12 hours then and try and get it when she sleeps. Oh, she's, she's kind of stuck. <laughs> oh god, she's not very coordinated. How is she noticing? How is she noticing when I pickpocket when she's just bumping into stuff constantly? <laughs> Is that her taking it back? Welcome back. <laughs> she doesn't seem that annoyed. She must be superstitious. She sleeps with- Oh, no, it's whiskey. I thought it was like some rat away underneath, but no. She just has a drinking problem. See, we're not so different after all, you and I. Oh my god, it is impossible to pickpocket her. I'm just lucky she seems to be okay with all of this. I've got you now. What? Oh no, oh no, this is not okay. This is not okay. Okay, he's already dead. Stop it. Yes, finally. I don't even want to tell you how long that took because you'll lose respect for me if I did. And I don't imagine you have a lot. <laughs> Surely they'll never expect this dude of robbing them, right? Can you... can you leave? I... I waited too long and now she's back in the office, so I, I waited so they'd all go sleep again and she's... well, she's stuck. Could you just... <laughs> all right, there we go. Uh, a little bit stuck. Okay. Oh, and off to bed. No wonder you sleep so soundly. You get your 10,000 steps in just at your desk. All right, let's open this bad boy. Nothing. Fantastic. May as well steal their money, I suppose. Well, then I'm gonna have to clear the road and I have no idea how to do that. I don't understand. The wiki said it would be there. I'm never trusting a wiki again. Now I get why teachers hate wikis. Okay, is it the scorpions or the ants that I have to take out or is it both? They don't seem that bothersome. They're just hanging out. Okay, now they seem bothersome when I walked into the middle of them. Okay, well, I can't deal with you, so I'll just take you this way. Wait, can you fight the scorpion? I've had a lot of success with that recently. Oh, now he's a pacifist too, apparently. Oh, no, he's he's dead. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I've spent most of this playthrough either as a pacifist or dead. Look at this. Fresh meat. Ooh, I'm so yummy. <laughs> follow me. Okay, they refuse to follow me far enough to the soldiers. I was thinking either the soldiers would win and then my problem is solved or they'd kill that specific soldier who gave me this job and then again, my problem is solved. 
Oh, someone's shooting at me. Hey, you like ants? Follow me. I've never been so happy to be shot. Oh, the big ant is heading his way. Although he's still shooting at me. Watch out behind you. Okay, okay. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Just give me a second, buddy. Yes, yes. Kill the ants. You can do it. Now stop reloading it. Oh my god, you're useless, aren't you? Oh Jesus, there's more of them. Okay, they killed one ant. Yes! <laughs> yes, they're using the range. Thank you, oh horrible bandits. Oh, I'm crippled. Hold on. Shoot at the ants, not me. Who's the bigger problem here? I'm just running around like a headless chicken. Oh no. Oh no. They're teaming up on me. <laughs> Yes! My elite squad! I'm just bringing them deeper and deeper into ant territory. Oh, come on, that's gotta be all of them. How many ants are there? And now I'm stuck with people shooting at me. It's the equivalent of bringing alligators into your home because you have a slight rodent problem. Okay, I think I'm good. I see them running off in the distance there. They've lost me. They must be confused what I was up to. <laughs> I'm like standing over her. I've been through a lot, okay? Cass has given you the whiskey rose perk. I already had every perk that is related to whiskey. Look how eager she is to follow me now all of a sudden. Come on, let's see what happens when I finally bring you here. Oh, isn't that cute? The kid playing with a mole rat. Brings me back to when I was a little mole rat being chased around by children. How come she was allowed in with her gun? <laughs> what the hell? You took everything off me and I looked defenseless. As I live and breathe, Rose of Sharon Cassidy. No, no, I'm I love peace. She's Cass. Was hoping you were on that caravan I massacred. But Wait, you massacred her caravan? I'm not with her, so watch the spread. <laughs> what the hell? Why are you still smiling? <laughs> For God's sake, after all that. Oh, I lost the perk. Well, there's my companion. That was fun. I'm glad it was fun for someone. Did you see the look on that bitch's face? Priceless. And what are you talking about? The look on her face? She was just blankly smiling. She had no idea what was going on. F made, I tell you. Stop swearing. All right, we got to do one more thing, apparently. Oh, 350 bottle caps. A pacifist's work is never done. And it's always hard. All right, a big arms deal. Oh, I just get teleported here. This is helpful. They're taking an awfully long time inspecting the weapons. Yeah, don't worry. I'm sure this will go over fine. If you need me, I'll be cowering in the corner like the pacifist I am. Things are about to get a little crazy. Oh, no. All right, best escape route. Those stairs. I mean, there's not much cover. Those boxes, they're beyond the enemies. That door, I could just run out. It's a trap. Fall back. It's some gas grenade. Okay, I found my hiding spot. I'll Harry Potter it. I'll be the boy who lived by hiding under the stairs with the Brahmin. Kill the remaining Legion troops. I mean, if I didn't kill the ants, I'm not going to kill the Legion. I think my side is winning, which is good. <laughs> All right, we did it, everyone. Look, I was right here on the front line. <laughs> what is this armor they've given me? Oh my god, I did not need that close up. I, I like the armor they gave me, but I, I would rather have their outfits. They're unconscious. They're not even dead, everyone. I mean, I should be celebrating that as I'm a pacifist, but you know. All right, this one's dead. I just think this dress will suit me. There we go. How do I look? Get some! What? You literally saw me getting changed. I'm not actually leeching. What the hell? I take it off. I'll be naked. Oh my god, they're still shooting at me. You have the IQ of a child playing peekaboo. I need to work out some last minute details with our new clients. But after that, we'll head back to the rush. Okay, but I should probably rush back because they're shooting at me. <laughs> He's still in combat mode. He hasn't quite come out. We made a lot of money. That's all that matters. Don't say anything else. I have no interest. You're probably wondering if you still have a job. I don't have anything open at the moment. <laughs> after all that, really? Maybe I can get a job as an exterminator after I dealt with those ants. You, you could use a person to sweep up, you know. You got a lot of corpses just kind of littering the floor with ash. This was not a job for a pacifist. I thought I was doing the right thing, just getting a regular Joe Schmo job. Good spring settler is fleeing. I came back to check on them. They're still fleeing and he still hasn't moved. Wait, there's a quest marker for this one. Where is it bringing me? What the... Right over here? It's bringing me to this spot, but there's no one here. Well, I guess that answers the question. You can play New Vegas as a pacifist, but you shouldn't. Both for your sanity and for the amount of bugs that it causes. So we will leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new. I would love to have you on the channel, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.